Well, my teeth, you go, you go say hot when cat is possible. Every day. Alright dear, how are you guys, we're on another day out, as you can see in the background, we were by a castle. So that back there is Keru Castle. And, and before you say it, yes Mr. Rickson, I know, I need a gimbal, alright, give me a break. I'll, uh, we're going in the woods, I'll swap around to the other camera now. So we're going through... This is a little walk. There's a path that basically goes around the whole thing. You'll be able to see some in the distance. There's an old water mill. For like a little damn reservoir thing. So there we go. You can just see the reservoir in the distance there. Luckily the tide's in today. Some more shots of the thing. Just uh Hurry up and catch up with our kids. Here we are, better shot. And there's the castle. You can actually walk around it, you can go in it. It's not refurbished or anything, it's like hollowed out inside, but yeah. So yeah, it's quite a nice lake. <clears throat> What was actually relatively calm. See people out here flying their drones and stuff. But yeah, sky is nice and relatively ish clear. And we're getting a bit closer to the water mill. <clears throat> so the water mill is actually housed in that building just there. It's like a little museum, you can go in there and look. Uh, the water wheel is still in place, unfortunately it's not functioning anymore. <clears throat> and my son's uh, riding his bike. We tried getting Becca on it, but on hers, but she wasn't having none of it. And we just, uh, give us a second, we'll get to the dam. So here we have the overflow. So this is a tidal. Uh, lake and uh, so that there is the uh, part of the one of the many sort of estuaries I suppose estuary uh, that feeds the uh, Kledai River so obviously as the tide comes in the gates which we'll see in a minute are opened up and then they close in obviously the it does actually carry on up there you can just see a little bridge so there is there is a river that feeds this from that direct from like over there and it comes into here which is why you're getting the overflow but yeah this is basically a big ass well I say big ass is a tiny one by regular standards but so yeah as you can see the um because the Kledai is a tidal the tides actually on its way back in so that's why the current is coming back in this way and in a second we will get to the uh, sluice gates all right so here we have the gates obviously not very watertight but they are very 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 old so obviously usually the tide will go in that way uh, which it will do eventually when it starts filling up from this side. Ooh, lovely. And yeah, it's another shot down there, the river. So yeah, this here is the mill house. I don't know if I can get a shot through the window, but we'll try. Don't know if you're going to be able to see anything up here. This is, say, usually a museum. Um, yeah, museum shut, but sometimes swans and stuff up here, which is quite cool. And let's just see what I'll do another one, another video, another day. But you can just about see in there, you can see the mechanisms for the wheel works. And 
some way around here is another one so there's some more stuff you can't really hear it but there's actually water underneath obviously there's a water wheel i think it's just over there yeah it's actually right just about make it out it's, i think it's just in there um the water wheel was actually quite a ways down um, but that's the viewing platform where you would look at it from inside the museum so yeah and then this path then goes all the way back up that side takes you around the other side of the castle and this is obviously the the other house of the family that used to sort of run the mill there's a grindstone and i don't know if you can hear the noise but i can't go i'm obviously not allowed any further but there's a water just in through there and that's a really nice little shop that does cakes and ice creams and stuff in the summer obviously it's late now it's like nearly seven o'clock so there we are so guys hope you enjoyed our little uh little vlog of our little walk around keru today um later on in the future i'll get some uh, we'll actually go in the museum we'll go around the castle and stuff so hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to leave a like don't forget to subscribe hit the bell icon and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye